Now to a growing problem facing high schools and universities around the world, an artificial intelligence software called Chat. GPT. Educators worry that students are using this technology to write papers. New York City's Department of Education recently banned ChatGPT. Students are using it to cheat on tests. What's terrifying about it is that it's learning software. It's designed to get better. A lot of negative PR about AI being not good for schools. But here in Willie School, it is really great to see how educators are coming together to see how AI can actually increase the quality of education. You see, during the pandemic, we saw the struggle that the teachers, the students and the parents went through. And that's when we as educators, you know, thought something has to be done about it. We, there has to be a better way we can teach kids. And that's when a small seed of PUD AI was sown. At the PUD AI event, we showcased more than 50 different apps that children can really use to develop their knowledge, their understanding of computational thinking, and most importantly, artificial intelligence. I've been through all the stalls and I was super surprised with how students have been trained to use AI, improving phonics, improving math skills. And I think this is actually how AI should be introduced in the school with children. It's a very well researched event, first of all. Very kudos to your school where they have researched so many tools. Not just the teachers, the students are very, very interested in showing their demos. Some students created such creative stories using AI on their own and it was very great to know how AI is also fostering creativity. And I realized there are so many things that even I didn't know which students explain to us more than you know any profession. And I think coming from the students with a live demo is a credibility in itself. Now I really know much more about AI than in the morning. So that's a really great event and it's really wonderful. And would like to see more schools doing something like this and more corporations coming together to promote this for children. You know, you have to understand that as an AI company, as an AI startup who are developing programs and products for children, you have to understand that your user is inside the classroom today, which means you want to get into school so that children can really take ownership and you as a designer of the product, you as the true architect of the solution, you are getting closer to the user.